They're trying to, to divert attention from the story that I wrote, which included enormous specifics. I was describing a process that began before Christmas of 2021. It involved the, the, uh, the National Security Advisor, Jake Sullivan, of the White House of the, uh, for the president. They had a series of meetings at a secret room in the White House uh, that I gave clues. I know the title of the room. They were asked to come up with both reversible and irreversible um, concepts, ideas. Um, uh, a reversible concept would have been more sanctions. Something irreversible would have been kinetic, uh, a bomb. And eventually it turned out that what they really wanted was to put down the pipelines. And certainly in this government, the concern was always been that as long as Germany was getting so much gas at such a cheap price from Russia, that it would be very hard to wean them away from Russia. I, I know that um, uh, the few things I know about the Ukrainian Navy is they are capable of dropping mines. I'm not an expert on it. I just happened to ask questions after that story came out. Um, they don't have a, a working de decompression chamber. What we're talking about are four pipelines, Nord Stream 1 and 2, each have two. They're steel tubes covered by a concrete cover to protect themselves from the salinity, the, the, the um, salt in the water. And when you actually see them, they're, as, they're six feet high, these concrete covers. So you have to have people that know that are, are the experts in underwater diving and experts in using the most, the plastic C4, the most volatile stuff there is. And also they have to be able to go quick. They have to be sure they get the bomb, the bomb in the, their, their weapon and the bomb in the right place that triggers and destroys everything. And they have to practice like, a, they practice for weeks and months on this, I would say in the waters of the Baltic Sea. Just not questioning their intelligence. These are all people uh, Tony Blinken and uh, the Secretary of State, uh, the one who didn't go to China because to meet his counterpart because of a balloon. Yeah. And J Jake Sullivan, who is the National Security Advisor, all have high degrees right. and the, the Under Secretary of State, plenty of intelligence. It's just what they're so driven by, I think, um, um, uh, uh, hatred of all things, particularly Putin and also communism per se. They're so cold warriors. They're really out of sorts, and it makes them do dumb things. I just think it's foreign policy is to complete idiocy, alienating a lot of people around the world. This notion of American uh, hegemony, if you will, it just doesn't work anymore. And so that's what I object to.